the midst of ongoing geopolitical tension, Greece and Turkey, two NATO allies, are rapidly advancing efforts to develop cutting-edge air defense systems. Despite their shared membership in the alliance, their approaches are notably divergent. However, one aspect unites them. Both nations are turning to Israel's renowned defense technologies for inspiration. Greece is looking to collaborate with Israel to either procure or co-develop systems similar to the Iron Dome, while Turkey is charting its own path with the development of the Steel Dome, emphasizing self-reliance in defense. In November 2024, Greece signaled its intention to deepen its defense collaboration with Israel. The primary focus of this partnership is to bolster Greece's air defense capabilities, with two possible options on the table, co-developing a customized defense system with Israel or procuring existing technologies like the Iron Dome or David Sling. The estimated €2 billion Euro investment reflects Greece's commitment to modernizing its military and securing itself against regional threats, particularly from Turkey, with whom it shares a fraught history of territorial disputes. Israeli defense systems have garnered global acclaim for their effectiveness in intercepting a wide range of threats. The Iron Dome, designed to intercept short-range rockets, has proven exceptionally effective in high-density attack scenarios. For medium-range threats, the David Sling system provides additional defense capabilities, while the Aero 3 is used for high-altitude, exo-atmospheric missile defense. Greece, recognizing the value of these multi-layered defense systems, aims to integrate such capabilities into its own military infrastructure. Already, Greece has strong ties with Israel, having deployed an anti-drone network based on Israeli technology in 2022. This system protects strategic sites, such as islands in the Aegean Sea, which are frequently overflown by Turkish military aircraft. Expanding this collaboration could provide Greece with enhanced protection and help counter emerging threats. On the other hand, Turkey is opting for a more independent approach to air defense. Strained relations with Israel, particularly in light of the ongoing conflict in Gaza, have pushed Ankara to focus on developing its own indigenous defense technologies. President Recep Tayyip Erdogan has publicly announced plans for a domestic air defense system, branded as the Steel Dome, to rival Israel's Iron Dome, demonstrating Turkey's drive for technological self-sufficiency. Turkey's domestic defense industry is already producing a range of air defense systems. The Korkut and Sunger systems are designed to replace older, US-made Stinger missiles, providing low-altitude defense, while the Hisaro offers medium-altitude coverage. At the top of this air defense network is the Cyper, a long-range system capable of intercepting threats up to 100 kilometers away. However, Turkey's acquisition of Russian S-400 systems in 2019 remains contentious, especially due to NATO concerns over compatibility and the resulting sanctions, complicating the integration of these systems within its broader defense network. The military developments in Greece and Turkey are a direct response to their long-standing rivalry, which is fueled by historical disputes over territories in the Aegean Sea, the Eastern Mediterranean, and Cyprus. These tensions, coupled with frequent military posturing, provide ample justification for both nations to heavily invest in advanced air defense systems. Each country's pursuit of sophisticated military technologies is not only about bolstering national security, but also about enhancing their regional deterrence capabilities. Israel's technological leadership in air defense is evident in the growing global interest in its systems. European nations, in particular, are increasingly adopting Israeli technologies to enhance their own defense capabilities. Germany, for example, recently acquired the Aero 3 system, while Finland, a new NATO member, chose the David Sling for its air defense needs. Other Central European countries, including Hungary and Slovakia, have integrated components of the Iron Dome into their arsenals. This trend highlights the increasing reliance on Israeli defense technologies across the globe, especially in Europe, where security concerns are rising amid changing geopolitical dynamics. For Greece, the collaboration with Israel strengthens its alignment with Western powers, notably the United States and the European Union. This strategy also enhances Greece's deterrent capability against Turkish military actions in contested areas. Meanwhile, Turkey's Steel Dome project is part of a broader effort to assert regional autonomy and reduce reliance on external suppliers. By developing homegrown defense technologies, Turkey aims to mitigate security threats and bolster its position as a regional power. The pursuit of advanced air defense systems by both Greece and Turkey carries significant strategic implications not just for the two nations but also for NATO. As the alliance strives to balance the competing interests of its members, these developments underscore the complexities of defense cooperation in the region. 
Greece's partnership with Israel serves to reinforce its ties to NATO's Western Bloc, while Turkey's independent development efforts, though ambitious, highlight the challenges of managing conflicting security interests within the alliance. These moves could also influence other regional players, such as Cyprus and Egypt, who may consider bolstering their own defense capabilities in response to growing tensions in the region. The militarization of the eastern Mediterranean, driven by these air defense advancements, could further destabilize an already volatile area. Although both Greece and Turkey are drawing inspiration from Israeli defense systems, their approaches reflect distinct political and strategic choices. Greece's collaboration with Israel is part of a broader effort to diversify its alliances, balancing relations with the US and the EU, while Turkey's focus on self-reliance underscores its desire for technological sovereignty. Strained Israeli-Turkish relations, coupled with Turkey's pursuit of alternative partners like Russia and China, mean that Israel's direct influence on Turkey's strategic development is limited. In conclusion, the contrasting approaches of Greece and Turkey to air defense development reflect not only political motivations but also the continuing influence of their rivalry. As both nations work to address evolving security challenges, their paths will shape the region's military landscape for years to come. These advancements highlight how historical disputes continue to drive modern defense strategies, with implications that extend well beyond the Mediterranean. Thank you.